Have you ever wondered how to make stop motion animation? Well, today, I guess I'll show you how to make it. Um, yeah. So first of all, you're gonna wanna pick out a nice board, Lego board like this. Then uh, to, if when you're animating and you move it, the Lego board might move a little bit. So to keep it down, flip it on its back side. You take some tape, roll in a ball, just like this, and you tape it down. I'm not gonna tape it all down right now for you, but you get the point. Tape it down. Um, and then you are going to put a little figure on it. We'll put a little rebel Lego guy. Alright. Now you are going to you're going to um say take a picture of him just straight. If you want to make him move you'll take a picture picture. I made a way of making him walk. You just move their leg up and take a picture. Move it down. Take a picture. Move it straight. Take a picture. And uh, just continue that process and it should look a little something like this. Now, there is more to um, stop motion, say with Legos, than just moving them. You can have them shoot a gun. This takes a lot of editing, though. Um, what you do is, you say, take a little droid or something. <laughs> and you take a picture of it. And then you kind of Photoshop the gun, so you make like a muzzle flash, and then have like a laser come out, and keep doing that. You don't, it doesn't have to be Photoshop though. Uh, I don't know. I don't do that though. Not yet, at least. But, you can also do mouth movement, which is basically the same thing. You just have their head, and you uh, edit the picture. I did all the pictures and just color on his mouth or something on a computer program, color on his mouth, not with crayons. <laughs> a lot of people use uh, Movie Maker for their Lego stop motions, but I use a little program. Uh, it's called Cyberlink Power Director. And you could change the speed to lower than 0 0.25, which is the lowest speed, or the highest speed you can have on Movie Maker. It could just go to 0 0.25. But I could go to as fast as I want it to on Power Director, and you have a lot more uh, editing effects too. I'll give you the links to a bunch of stop motion programs in the uh, description. Um, some, a lot of them aren't free, but there are a lot of free programs out there. Um, the best would probably be Stop Motion Pro, which is like $600 for the HD one. I don't know. It's really expensive, though. But, yeah, there's just a little short tutorial on how to do stop motion. Bye.
So there you have it. That's a tutorial on how to do stop motion. And I hope this helped. And if you did learn how to do stop motion from this video, I'd like you to post it as a response. So I can see if it does help people get better at stop motion. Thanks for watching. Bye.